my own pink world. I get up out of bed and get ready for school. Hey, Mustangs! <laughs> They're so cool. All dolled up, just heading quick to class. Come on, we got important things to do. It's her, A, and him, A, and me, and you, and pink. Goes with everything. Uniform from head to toe. I'm ready to go, you know, you know. It's pink. Good enough to drink. We like all the colors, but pink just looks so good on us. E, positive, I, iconic, N, never late, K, Mustang. Welcome back, Mustangs. We are looking alive. Speaking of alive, the theme for NCYC this year was fully alive. Ooh, that's right. Let's see how alive our Mustangs were in Indianapolis. Okay, it's Caitlin. And Bailey. And we made at NCYC. Um, right now we're just sitting in the lobby with our group. And why don't we go take a look at all the other ducks from BBHS? Okay, um, we're gonna go do some interviews of the participants. Come with. <laughs> Who am I here with? Miss Tallarigo. <laughs> um, have you ever been to NCYC? I have, as a student and a teacher. Okay, can you tell us about your experience? It was awesome. Great. <laughs> Everybody should do it. What are you most excited for? Um, when 30,000 of you guys go to Mass and experience the Eucharist, that's probably the coolest part ever. I'm excited to experience it. And then one more thing. What do you expect to get out, or I guess us, to get out of this since you've already been? Um, a stronger faith and a lot of new friendships from across the country. All right. Who are we here with today? Regan. Kirsten. Have you ever been to NCYC? Yup. Yes. What are you most excited about this year? Um, I'm excited for King and Country is performing and I'm hyped about that. And I'm excited to meet new people. I'm, exci I'm excited to meet new people. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited for all the music. All right, thank you guys. I'm Nadia Shirley. I'm Kirsten Key. And we're about to uh, race on this little bounce house thing. I'm about to turn up. Um, I'm, I'm winning. I am winning. Right now, we are making um, bags and shirts for the children in Haiti. So my shirt has a zebra on it and a working on a snake. And I'm going to add a couple more animals. Um, I'm here with Abby Tweehus. What are you drawing? It's a shirt and it has a tiger on it. All right, Nadia. Uh, I did a shirt and mine has an elephant on it and it's gonna say, be happy. Um, I have a bag and it has a bird and a duck and with little duckies on it. Okay, Bailey. I am doing frogs with crosses on it. Great job. So right now we are in line to get into the Lucas Oil Stadium, which is behind you. If you look at this line, there's so many people. I think there's supposed to be like 30,000 people that are gonna be in here. But yeah. We're about to go listen to some king and country. Woo. Woo. Okay, right now we are live at the Lucas Oil Stadium waiting for the concert to begin. The stadium is slowly filling up. So whose lipstick is that? I'm mine. You bought it? Yeah. Where'd you buy it at? Here we are live listening to the band for king and country.
We are going into the Jesus Zone. Oh yeah! Okay, we just made cards, Christmas cards. This is mine. Put Merry Christmas. And then have an amazing Christmas season. Happy holidays. Okay, Bailey, show me what you made. I made a Merry Christmas card with a beautiful Christmas tree. Okay. Okay, now we're at the team building like exercise. And it's Nadia, Bailey, Ava, and Jesse's behind the camera. And today we are going to succeed very well in this team bonding activity and make it all the way to the top. I'm gonna fall. Okay, who am I here with? Jimmy. Uh, what diocese are you from? Um, Indiana. Um, what's your favorite part about NCYC so far? Uh, I got a I got a bag of chips earlier. Oh, very solid. Okay, and if you could describe NCYC in one word, what it would it be? Pretty cool. Okay, okay, great, solid answers. Thank you. Okay, I am here with CC. And I'm going to be asking her questions about her day two, what her experience is like for NCYC. So, what was your favorite part about today so far? Um, I went to a general session, which is like a little talk about mental health and faith. It was really, really good. We listened to a lot of music. I swapped hats a lot. Yeah. How, how much are you excited for this next activity? I'm so hyped. I have a good feeling. I have like... I think it's going to be really fun. I've made a lot of friends, so I'm hoping to make some more. Yay! Alright, who am I here with? Hunter. Okay, so which diocese are you from? St. Cloud Diocese in Minnesota. And what does NCYC stand for? NCYC stands for the National Catholic Youth Association, or, God, what's that C? Convention. Convention. Okay. All right, and then what's your favorite thing been about NCYC so far? Right now, my favorite thing is right now is visiting all the um, spots that you can go in the gym, seeing all the different things with all the um, shirts is really, really fun, and all the games that we've yeah, been able to I do. Agree, I agree. Thank you so much. Okay, all right, who am I here with? Macy Bullard. All right, what diocese are you from? Indianapolis. Okay, so what does NCYC stand for? National Catholic Youth Conference. Uh, what's been your favorite thing so far? Um, definitely the adoration last night and the concerts. Yeah. Agreed, it was really good. Okay, and then if you could describe NCYC in one word, what would it be? Um, moving. Okay, good answers. I hope you had a good Thanksgiving break. Speaking of Thanksgiving, let's check out the turkey bowl.
My favorite part was our MC's handshake. You just had to have been there. Carly, what's your favorite Christmas song? Hmm, probably Grandma Got Ran Over by a Reindeer. What about yours? Probably Mary Did You Know. It's such a pretty song. That is a good one. I wonder what Mr. Sharp thinks of our favorites. Let's check it out. I'm here with Mr. Sharp and he's gonna be rating Christmas music. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Yes. So what do you want to read? Read it one out of ten and tell me what you like or don't like about it. Uh, one out of ten, I'll give that one like an eight. The reason is, is I like the cartoon so much. I've liked it for years. I think it fits the cartoon perfectly. Fun fact, never saw the original cartoon. That's yeah, a shame. I failed as a father. <laughs> well, we're doing this one this, this year, actually. Actually, it's a very overplayed song, and I just found out last week it was actually ripped off. She got sued and only got only gets 50% of the rights now. But um, overall, I actually think it is a very good song. But uh, I understand why people are a little sick of it. One out of ten? Well, I'd have to give that one an eight, too. It's a really good song, actually. You know Dasher and Dancer oh. and Prancer and Vixen. Uh, I'll give this one about a six. I'm actually not too high on this song. Um, can't quite put my finger on it, it's just not very good. Hi. I don't know, I just don't like it that much. Oh, please calm down, that's, this is a good song. I don't know why I haven't done this one yet. Look at this dude. I'll, I'll give that one a 7 out of 10. I actually do really like that song. If you, that's one song, if you don't know, most Christmas songs are in 3-4 timing. That one's particularly not, but um, most Christmas songs are in 3-4 timing. They kind of have a swing to them. That one's not, but it's still a good song. Yeah. What does that song mean in Spanish? Feliz Navidad. Merry Christmas. Miss We Would Be Proud. Oh, hell, oh my God. This is a 9 out of 10. It's one of my favorite Christmas songs. I love Elvis Presley. Oh, 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 I'm here with Dr. Valentino, and will you give us a fit check? Sure thing. Today is the last Tuesday that uh, we're going to have in November. So this is my last week to, to rock the, the, the fall theme, right? So we got our, our uh, changing leaves here in fall colors, right? 1945 Wittenauer uh, for the watch. And uh, something for outdoors, since right now we're having flurries. All right, so the coat with the velvet collar is known as a Chesterfield, and the hat is a Hamburg, also called a Godfather hat. I'm going to make him an offer he can't refuse. Because Michael Corleone wears it in the movies. Wow, that has to be one of my top fall fits from Dr. V. I don't know. I think our basketball teams are doing good. Let's see how tinsel-tastic our basketball team's doing. Abby, you know what time of the year it is? Basketball season. On Monday night, the boys' basketball team played Villa Madonna and got that dub. Also on Monday night, the girls traveled to Harrison County and also got that dub. On Thursday night, the boys' basketball team also got that dub, 76 to 49 against Calvary. Top five plays of the week. Number five. Okay, so we got Alex Combs with a dunk. Darn. What are you doing? Number four, we got Kylie Smith stealing the ball, going up for a layup, easy dub. Number three, we have Kylie Smith stealing the ball, passing it to Greeley Kramer, Greeley Kramer, oh, you just got sauced. Number two, here we have Dom Haddon, he gets a steal. He runs, he runs, he goes all the way up, and one! 
All right, number one. We got Dom Haddon with the rebound, popping out to Alex Combs, and he hits the three. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. That's all for sports. Wow, it looks like we need to wrap up this week. Get your ice scrapers out, Mustangs. Gwen, what are you doing? No Shave November is over. Gotta get rid of it. Right. Who else had a beard for No Shave November? I'm not sure. Let's take a look. Mustangs. We'll see your baby faces next week. Merry Christmas!